Hi everyone. In this video, we will be discussing about keystroke level model. So this model is comes under the category physical and device model. So under this, there are two different models that have been discussed. One is keystroke level model. Other one is Buxton's three state model. So anyway, we will be discussing. Uh, in this video about keystroke level model so maybe you can recall the physical and device model apart from that there are linguistic model and cognitive models and under cognitive models we have discussed about uh, gohm's model and in uh, linguistic model we have discussed about bnf and tag so here uh, we will be discussing about a uh, keystroke level model in GOMS model, it is focused more on uh, the task and it's not uh, focusing on how the tasks are implemented. So there are two phases, like we call it as accusation phase and ex execution phase in completing a task. So in case of accusation task, it is like which is being implemented in GOMS model, but it is not focusing on execution model. What I mean execution in sense. In case of GOMS model, we break the task into some sub similar tasks, but we, we are not focused on how it is being implemented. But normally, if you want to perform a task, like if you want to shut down the system, what is the thing? You are supposed to make your mind that I am going to do a shutdown. Then I have to use my mouse or keyboard. In case I am using the keyboard, then I have to use a suitable shortcuts. Else, I have to use the mouse to click on the particular menu to select the shutdown option so that means to perform a particular task we need to have some mental preparation as well as some motor skill by which my hand has to perform and I, my eyes has to coordinate with the visual screen so that is what we will be focusing in keystroke level model how <clears throat> with respect to uh, human motor skill is being implemented so we will be using the empirical knowledge of human motor system. So there are certain tasks, uh, not tasks, there are certain empirical uh, knowledge instance, the statistical data which tells you like how much time is required to click on a particular button or how much time it takes you to make some mental preparation to do a particular task. So this is what I am talking about accusation as well as execution. So next is uh, about uh, the what are the execution phases are there so here uh, in klm model the keystroke level model we will be focusing on how we are going to make an execution so the execution or the physical motor uh, performance of the human or uh, subdivided into any of these the following uh, keystroking like if i am using a keyboard i need to make some words or a word phrase or something else so in case of B, it is pressing a mouse button or I may be pointing on a particular menu or homing in a sense from maybe if I am switching from mouse to keyboard or keyboard to mouse where I need to make a homing that is I have to keep my hands over the keyboard or maybe onto the uh, mouse. Then drawing in case you are involved in drawing or any other uh, kind of application then this is applicable and M stands for mental preparation and sometimes if you click on certain button on the application it may take some time to response so even that time is included to calculate how much time is required to complete a particular task so the, we will be using these notations k b p h d or m or r to represent these activity so the time to execute a particular task will be a combination of all these things combination sum of TK is nothing but time required for keystroking, time required for TB and time required for TP that is for positioning your mouse or time required for TH and some of or almost all these things are calculated statistically and these values are already listed. So this data is taken from Lawrence Helbram Associates and has been uh, available in uh, the textbooks also. So it tells you about what are the different operators are there and about the remark like in case of key k it is nothing but key plus and with a good typist and with a poor typist 
what is the number of words per minute is going to type and how much time it requires to type a individual word or for a particular minute how much time it is so these values are already calculated statistically and in this case like you can find the maximum value is given here 1.35 which is for mental preparation so obviously <clears throat> it'll take more time for you to think or desire like what task i'm going to perform then obviously you will be combining any of these things either to uh, press the bounce button or whether you are going to use your uh, home and to and from the keyboard or drawing or whether you are going to wait for some time for the <clears throat> response from system so here this i can indicate that we are uh, ignoring the system response time that is a mean so we'll discuss with an example for uh, klm so same uh, thing which we have discussed for gomes model but there we have discussed with respect to the sub task here it is based on the time calculation how much time it takes to complete uh, this particular task so my goal is same thing i am going to icon the window there are two methods one is using close method or i will be using a control w method and this control w method will be used for uh, whenever i am performing a game operation and for rest of the application this is applicable so to use close method what are the things i am supposed to do i have to move over the mouse to the file menu then i have to wait uh, for the pull down menu to show the options then i will be selecting the close option from the file menu so these activities are involved so in case i am using a shortcut i will be using only control w so just observe this table uh, you can see with respect to close method that is i am talking about this one where warming is required then i have to make a mouse click sorry m is for mental preparation so how much time it takes for mental preparation then k is for key stroking or selecting control w key which is like 0.28 seconds so all these values are in seconds if i am going to use this <coughs> close method that is uh, this one this close method so actually it's given in this way uh, control w method is given um, as column 1 and close method is given as column 2 so here in case of close method what i am supposed to do i am supposed to select the menu that is i am positioning the menu then i have to click the left button then my mental preparation of doing it and i have to make a uh, positioning of that uh, menu then clicking it up so this is what so this entire duration takes to complete the task is around 3.75 second and with control w method it is 2.03 seconds so obviously it's understood that by using a control w method it takes very lesser time to complete the task so this is a way of calculating uh, the performance of your system based on different options like we have two different method of doing it there are alternative methods like control 